here back with another video and today yes we are going to be building some teams for this upcoming kagi league you know I'm, i just like switching around teams and i know people don't really have good teams um you know i really enjoy making teams so if you are new to my channel make sure you do leave a like and subscribe and join our discord server and yeah let's just get straight into the video guys starting off starting off all right so um uh, i'm gonna go with the killer b team first so obviously killer b blazing bash pain right um then you're gonna have Mike Guy and Blazing Bash Madara. Even though Blazing Bash Madara is gonna get one shotted from seven star Madara, is still good. It's still good. You can do Kagi Lee Kagia seven star Madara, but if you want to be really toxic, put Blazing Bash Kagia. It's a, <laughs> like Blazing Bash Kagia just destroys, bro. If you want to do that, but we're gonna go with that. See, now I need to. If your Mike Guy's maxed out. Put your Mike guy right there in the middle. He gets a speed boost as long as with Killer B. They're both giving speed to Killer B if they're all close together. And yeah, this is a really good team too. Alright, so let's just get into the next team. Next team, obviously, you could cross Shisui out. He's not going to be in this meta. Definitely Shisui's not going to be in this meta. Um, she's like the 4th, 5th fastest unit. Um, I honestly think you should go with so Jiraiya. He's like a really good unit. By the way, like, he's so good, like, his, um, he can't get immobilized if he sync with short range. Um, he boosts his skill element by 35 to 70, which is really good. So if you're close to him, he's obviously going to give a 70, 35 to 70 speed boost, and it's going to be really helpful. So I, what I would do is put 7 star Madara, Blazing Bash, Blazing Bash Madara, alright? Because, um, if you think about it, he doesn't really need Blazing Bash paint. But if you want to just do this, 7 Star Madara, Blazing Bash Pain, Jiraiya, and then Blazing Bash Madara, then Kagi Lee Guy, and probably Kaguya, that would be really good too. I mean, you could always switch it around just to outspeed the second row if someone has a Blazing Bash Pain in the first row. Just to outspeed, you could do that. But I think this, this is good too. Madara. Or if you don't want to put Madara. If you do not want to put Madara, or if you don't, you can put 7 star Sasuke instead of Jiraiya. They have the same speed. 426, 426. I mean, I, I'll rather off be putting 7 star Sasuke here because you can just put the Blazing Bash Pain here, but it, it's, it's good either way. So let's just get into the next one. So, um, now this Abito, don't get me wrong, he's a pretty solid good unit. I'm not gonna lie. I did use him in the Kagi League B Kagi League, and he was actually coming in clutch. This man was literally over here switch chilling everything, bro. He was switch chilling Jutsu ceiling. He's a free to play unit. If he came out, you should have maxed him out. I am going to max limit break him for, and max speed pill him for he have that 400 speed past that um, with the speed boost. Remember, you can always do this, uh, but I don't think that's going to work. Abito can get immobilized, but still, he can switch seal and Jutsu seal if anything happens to Madara. Um, he has resistance, I think, and he can have speed. All right, all right. Jiraiya gives a speed boost to uh, thing. So Jiraiya gives a speed boost to Abito, I meant. So Abito will get a speed boost. So just keep that in mind because that's gonna be really clutch if you're like all together. Basically like a Mike guy in this Kagi League. Now my Abito can, he's really dodgy. Um he does have a mobilization resistance. That's only like 20%, which is not that bad. Um he boosts his boosts his speed by 15. That's his buddy skill. So you could put him behind Madara and he could like boost speed. If you know what I mean. Or you can do something like this. But I'm going to show you the next team that I have in store. Um, and yeah, let's just get into the next one. Pretty good. Um, this is like if you don't. So as I told you, that buddy skill is giving a 15 speed boost to Madara. Which he is going to have around 25. Uh, like around 430 something. Then you're gonna have oh no 400 and yeah yeah 430 or 50 something. All right, then you're gonna have um Jiraiya giving that 30 to 70 speed boost, and you're also gonna have Mike Guy. Or you could do it like this if you really want to. Um, Mike Guy is gonna Abito can switch shield if Madara wins the speed tie. He probably is since he has all these speed boosts coming in, and Abito can switch shield and Jutsu seal. He has a chance of doing it. He he's really dodgy, so he can clutch up. Um, then you have Pain and Mike Guy. 
but only reason I did this Jiraiya and Kaguya because remember Jiraiya can get oh Jiraiya can't get immobilized I just realized that Jiraiya can't get immobilized but since my my guy isn't maxed out I would put my my guy right there under Kaguya which would be really good team this is a pretty solid team so yeah this is going to end it for the video if you are new to my channel make sure you do hit that subscribe button leave a like um comment teams that you're going to run for